Uh, hello there. Uh, this is Mr. Critic, and uh, I think uh, we are ready to finish the scenario in Norway. Just let me check something. I do not quite remember where I saved uh, the game, so uh, April. Uh huh. Third of April. Yes, uh, I believe this was the last turn. Yes. Okay. Now I need to save this to a different location because um, September. Okay, so mm, I will now save this to September the 24th. Norway. Um, finish. I believe we have uh, three turns or maybe four turns remaining for a major victory, so uh, instead of just taking over the city of Namsos, uh, we will do some more damage and maybe take some more objectives too. So tomorrow overcast, let us hope for this, because the weather is very bad for the last couple of turns and uh, it is difficult, you know, to to play um, without the support of Luftwaffe. So, mm, now the big guys have arrived and let's put them to use. Done better, but okay. Much better. Now for the subs. Okay, and now we destroy this battleship and then we are pretty much done with the enemy forces. Okay, one destroyer remaining, but uh, this is not a problem. We will attack this destroyer now and um, uh, the next turn it will also die. Okay, so now we will bring uh, this light cruiser closer to the cities, so we can start shelling them. Uh, we move our paratroopers here, so they can embark on an airplane on the next turn. And, as I said, we will start shelling this city. <coughs> very unlucky with my navy as far as attacking infantry goes oh. 
only said it and <laughs> things improved immediately. Okay. So there is probably somebody hiding in this city. And next to it. But we will go for the city of course. any additional support here? No, I don't think so. So we will just bring destroyers closer so they can take turns on the infantry. As for this guy, uh, should I reinforce it or? I think it would be possible, especially if weather improves, to just uh, bring it here and take over the city with the strength of 3 because I think I will reduce the strength of this guy um, or prob probably even destroy it of course if the weather turns uh, for the better ok so uh, we could now um, take over the victory objective, but we will not. Fuel of 10, supply. Yeah. In these conditions, it is very difficult for units to move, especially if they are in trucks. So I'm scouting a little bit and I will use this unit now to attack the aircraft carrier. And with success. Very nice. Uh, now with the main threads gun I can bring uh, also this heavy cruiser which is crippled closer you know just to help with the shelling also this sub and this destroyer okay now we deal with uh, these infantries and of course these tanks <coughs> Infantry just pop out, so we will go for it. Now we attack this tank, even though it is there is a possibility it will retreat in the victory objective, perhaps even try to take over the airport, but we will not worry about this. The battle is basically over, I'm just destroying what's left of the 
Norwegian force and British expeditionary force. Um, but not, you know, just for fun, but to gain more prestige and uh, even most more important, more experience for my units. Um, now, now, there is, you know, one thing. Now I could start overstrengthening uh, my e units, but since the next scenario is slow countries, um, which is, uh, I think, the easiest scenario of the entire campaign, I will just let them be like they are, and you know, um, overstrengthen them then in Belgium. So, but we are pretty low on fuel. Just let me see. Um, okay. Uh, now we place the units over uh, the enemy units. So, on the next turn, if of course the weather improves, we will be able to attack them immediately and then use another unit, if available of course, to attack them again. So we need three units um, around this infantry to prevent it to reinforce. One is already stationed here, it is a destroyer. But we can bring some other units, uh, you know, down to take on the next turn some more enemy units. You, you need to experience. And you two will just change places. So we will now save the game. Come on, overcast tomorrow. I need experience for my air units too. Okay, let us end this now. Hmm. I'm not very lucky with my submarines in this game because um, they often, you know, evade uh, the attacks of destroyers, but okay, no problem. Hmm. So the weather is fair, which means I can uh, use my Luftwaffe to its full potential, but the ground is still frozen, so... And he has purchased huh, two more <laughs> units. <laughs> okay, no, no problem. Attack. So I made a mistake here, um, because now mm, <sighs> I am afraid to disembark because of these two units, I don't want to lose my... Okay, nobody's perfect. Mm. Can I reach an airport after this? This is the question now. It's uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9... Then yes, I can. Okay. Yes, we can. <laughs> Good motto. Mm. 
least one unit is gone now. <coughs> but with these bombers, I will need to attack uh, this infantry. hoping for a better result. Now let us try to force the aircraft carrier out of the uh, port of Namsos. And we did. Very good. Now we have put uh, this aircraft into harm's way here. Uh, that was also the reason why we uh, pushed it out, you know, of the port. Okay, even when you lose, uh, you know, some units, you get experience for it, so this fighter has, I believe, now close to 50 of experience. Let us check, yes, 57, very good. And since we have brought this aircraft close here, we can now attack it twice. No effect. Maybe you will be lucky. Yes. Uh, can you sink uh, this carrier now? Or should I? Should I? Maybe. Um, hmm. Yes, I should bring this one closer because this destroyer will be gone on the next turn and it will pose no danger to my crippled heavy cruiser. Yes, very good. Now some more target practice for my Luftwaffe. Excellent. Mm. Air units, okay. Um. So this one is a gunner, so I will actually bring uh, the bomber here to help taking the city of uh, Moirana. Strange name. No effect, fortunately. Maybe you will do better. You did. Very good. And now, if I'm not very unlucky, I will be able to destroy this unit or force it to surrender.
Mm, excellent. Now, <laughs> this tank has three stars of experience, so this is going extremely well. Um, there is another reason I forgot to mention before why I'm not, you know, overstrengthening my units um <coughs> in this uh, scenario. I would like to turn uh, mo well, all would be would be best, but um, uh, you know, uh, infantrys uh, in this state are pretty weak, and we need uh, bridge engineers and we need um, armored uh, transport. So this is why I'm saving all of this prestige for the next scenario because. Uh, bridge engineers rule, you know, uh, they are the greatest infantry of the entire war and I want them um, as soon as possible uh, Especially in France and then in England uh, they will be very useful, you know, so Okay, so uh, Since we do not need this unit we will Take this infantry. Now has a strength of six, but it is uh, still too much for me to risk, you know. Has a spotting of two. I don't want to be unlucky on the next turn, so I will bring uh, these paratroopers here. And I made th uh, this was a silly mistake actually, so I apologize. I really thought that he will, you know, uh, the enemy. No, I don't. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking about. It was just stupid. So, yeah, bad move. <sighs> yeah. Okay. So now we go for um, yeah okay so since this is uh, the last naval unit i think we will attack it with our submarine because submarines <coughs> are incapable of, of firing on um, ground units so okay uh, what stats do we get here uh, three destroyed. Okay, three destroyed. And here zero. F Still, we need to attack. Nothing is expe expected. Nothing. Hmm. So I think it is more important to advance here than to uh, deal with these Matildas who are gunners so okay come on do some damage very good again yes This unit should die now. Very good. We still have a ship, so we will attack this Matilda too. It's actually Matilda 1, but... <laughs> Just kidding.
okay so um, what else do we have in the air department nothing except for this uh, stuka here mm, okay Unfortunately, um, I forgot um, on which turn I have to win this to still achieve a major victory. I think when there are seven, where there are seven turns remaining, I can still do it. But after that, I'm not sure. So I will have to save this game again. Okay, Sabi, you are safe. You too, destroyer. Nah. So this infantry will be attacked now. we move this bomber over this infantry because um, it is still at full strength so now I will save this game again Norway finish uh, September so this is Norway Finish zero zero two. Ah, not enough room. So fin zero zero <laughs> zero zero two. Okay. 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 Mm. Very good. Uh, we have almost a thousand of prestige points. So some good upgrading for the next uh, scenario and the weather is supposed to be fair and dry tomorrow uh, excellent so we have at least two more turns to and it is fair and it is dry we have at least two more turns to win a major vict victory mm. as expected he has placed his unit in a city running out of units so we will try to uh, use mostly our fighters and bombers of course now just a little bit of cheat because I want to know if I missed anything I don't want to destroy the very last unit and then get a major victory okay so um, yes this is it no more cheating <sighs> okay 
we attack this infantry. With an excellent result. Now for come on, do some damage and earn some experience. Very nice. And now you are at 65, so in low countries you will already have a star or more. The wind blew my paratroopers away. Um, any more units to attack with our air forces? Uh, no. So now we will use our ground forces. Perhaps we will save this Matilda <coughs> until the end, you know. So there is one unit remaining. This is important. So let us surround this unit. Attack. Very good. this unit will be out of ammo on the next turn we will use it and then completely encircle Matilda which still has ammo and will probably attack my truck on the next turn but I actually do not care So we will just uh, move these units so they will not appear when we are clicking in our next unit. Ah, out of field. You too. 
this is because of the frozen ground in the previous turns when the ground is frozen uh, the units uh, are I believe using twice as much fuel to move around I think it's twice as much I'm not sure so okay you go here you two can No, no need to do, to do this. And we will not uh, attack with our ships anymore because um, they are only auxiliary units and we will um, finish off uh, the remaining uh, enemy units with our core units just for the experience of course um, we save again close to a thousand excellent and we confirm the end <laughs> and of course he did attack my truck <laughs> Now if I was, you know, nitpicking, I would probably remove this destroyer to allow him to purchase more infantry, but uh, no, no, I don't want to off-screen this, I will uh, finish this scenario um, on screen, so you can see what happens, and uh, I do not care for some extra experience points. Save. Now, damage it, but do not destroy it, please. Um, did I mention that you should damage it a little bit? <laughs> okay. Same mission for you. Nothing. Okay, be that way. Very good. Now we go for this unit, we have zero fuel, but still we are expected, ex expected to win this battle. <coughs> Is it two stars now for me? No, still not. Okay. Then on in the next scenario you will have two stars. last city is taken uh, we have more than 1000 of prestige and now we will finish this by taking the last objective let us just check the casualties so 39 infantries one tank three artillery Two air defense, one fort, yes, this was uh, south uh, near Oslo. 
5 fighters, 2 tactical bombers, 9 destroyers, 6 capital ships uh, to land transports of course and an aircraft carrier. So uh, Royal Navy is gone. And we have won a decisive victory. And you Matilda will um, remain alive because uh, I get more prestige by taking the last victory objective than by destroying you. So good for you. <laughs> uh, now we will save this. Norway F I zero zero three and this is it. X is major victory. Uh, if we go on, uh, we can see that. The general staff has commended us for outstanding achievements in Norway. And we now have a key role in the invasion of France. But prior to the invasion of France, we will have to defeat the Low Countries, uh, which I um, already said that uh, it is the easiest scenario of the entire campaign. And we will have plenty of time, you know, to <coughs> upgrade, give elite replacements, and also overstrength our units so thank you for watching this um, i hope i will be able to produce another video soon until then bye bye